got League Cup. Fleetwood uh, apparently haven't been to the second round. Yeah. So having um, an observation is that for you? I think last year we broke a few records, so that is one we want to break this year, uh, definitely. Um, spoke to the chairman. Um, target is definitely to go into the next round for the first time in the history of the club. And um, that's what we try to, to do. Carnot United, you'll be the favourites. You're at home, they're in League 2, you're in League 1. How do you see it? Uh, yeah, it was last year in uh, in League One. It was last year in League Two, and we lost four two. So um, that tells you that tells you how much of a favourite we are. Yeah, but a year on, do you feel the club is in a, a better um, state than it was when the that early part when you'd only just taken over? Um, last week, uh, last week, uh, sorry, last year, uh, we played in the Czech Trade that game, and uh, tomorrow we have a, a different team out there than we had in the Czech Trade. Out there. Are you going to make big changes or just, just a few sort of little... We will have a different team out there like we had last year on the check of training. Mm. Right. Um, and there's one or two players who didn't play at the weekend. Wes Burns, for example, who, you know, a lot was made of him coming back to the club. Where does he fit in at the minute? Every player knows, and it's not only for Wes, yeah. uh, every player knows uh, what gets him in the team and every player knows what doesn't get him into the team. Are you not and that counts for everybody. Sure. Uh, I think we are quite clear... Uh, what we expect from players in their position um, on a level of performance um, and um, that counts for every player I'm not, I'm not speaking particularly to, uh, about rest I'm speaking about the whole thing um, we know that we rotate uh, we know that we uh, we're having the quality to rotate because we're not shooting ourselves in the shoot by in the foot by just rotating for the sake of it, we're only doing it because we believe that the players who not started the last game might be a good solution for the next one. And um, but obviously, I need to judge what I see on the training pitch and on the field in terms of performances. And every player, every player knows uh, what gets him into the team. How satisfied were you with the fact that, despite losing what three or four key players, the lads that you brought in just seen a slot into those positions really well. I think it's very early days. Um, I think uh, when we talked about our pre-season in general, that gave me a good indication where we are as a team. Um, um, also the, the new players, what you just mentioned. Um, I think that didn't change my opinion about the pre-season, the second half against Preston. Um, I think new players bringing something to us, some, some new elements, um, uh, some elements they have to still get adapted to. Um, I think it's a good mix what we brought in and with what we already had. Uh, and I think it's a, a process, a working process, is that the right yeah, word? Yeah, yeah. And um, we just won game into the season and um, it's too early to, to make any conclusions whatsoever. There will be many up and downs, and uh, but so far so good, and I think that started already since the players joined us. And nineteenth, we started the preseason already the nineteenth of June, um, and um, I already got a good conclusion about where we are. And I wasn't surprised that we pulled out the performance like we did against Rotherham United.